Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and time for 5v5 at long last. Always good to get back to 5v5. Uh, my opponent today is Kotoki Hajimi. He's in Chewbacca. I feel like I've been facing a lot of these guys lately from Chewbacca. They're all pretty good competitors. Uh, 11.5 million. Not too shabby at all. Got close to a million on me. Uh, of course, Reva there. Uh, most people have Reva at this point. Or most people up here have Reva at this point. If I got her, most of the people I'm going to play have her too. Um, but it's also got a few extras. I know he has Seer. Uh, and I saw Seer and I actually kept General Skywalker on offense for her. Uh, but nothing like brand new uh, is finished. I mean, Marin isn't quite finished. Saw it's on the way. Captain Rex. Um, buying some shards clearly, but not fully done yet. So uh, nothing brand new to worry about. Uh, Seer is the newest one. Uh, and we got a lot of set 8 Datacrons. Some set 9, but not enormous inventory. So not too much of a worry. And... They, they got profundity, so I'm not going to check the ships anymore. And they actually attacked already, which is good because I got 1784. It's not a bad score, but it's definitely beatable. Um, if I full clear one shot, then I'm fine. You ended up setting Dartrea on defense, Lord Vader on the front, Malgus, and uh, the Zori team. Uh, but no turbos on the front wall. And I thought it would be clever setting... Uh, JMK on the back wall, but they didn't have a problem there either. And these two are just kind of like throwaways. After I decided to go heavy offense, I was like, eh. I don't absolutely need something crazy there. I got past Tuskens, got past Sorty. Maybe I need to put Dark Trooper there again. Um, but they failed on General Grievous, which I was happy to see. And then Afra, they got past it. So probably used CLS or something there. Um, and then on, but on fleets, uh, they did drop to malevolence, so that's where the extra banners came in, uh, giving me plenty to work with as long as I play my cards right. However, they did set a pretty good defense. What I'm scared about the most is actually Lord Vader up here, um, just with the extra durability. Um, I think it's going to be kind of tricky um, with Maul or nine too. I gotta, I'm playing on using Springlitter, Kylo, Night Sisters, and then Watt and Armor. Um, it's been working in Arena, even against the squad with Reva and Grand Inquisitor in it, uh, and Maul, which I think is better. Uh, I got a Sana team with Hondo, not too scared of that. Dash, not scared of that. Afra, I think CLS can still handle that, uh, but not totally sure. I'm probably gonna try that. Uh, but down here, Got some more tough stuff. Ray uh, with Ben Omicron, although I'm happy to see, or Ben Datacron, though I'm happy to see the Ben one because it's not that great against Starkiller, and I do want to try Starkiller here. Got uh, Malgus, Seer, and Java. Uh, I, I'm not totally comfortable on what to do with Java this season. Last season I did Afra all the time, uh, but I'm going to start trying, I'm going to try Ray. Which, you know, might be ill-advised, but I'm going to do it. Uh, but I definitely don't want to do gas here. So I'm going to start with that. And I'm gonna, just going to take one of these level 5s. Has a little bit of extra protection on top of everything else I got. Got the cow one right here. So Rex is going to get stunned and go. And they got all that. A lot of crit avoidance. Uh, but they don't have Maul on the team. So I'm a little bit less afraid. Yeah, not even... Color red on mass, so gas is just a clean counter. As long as I can handle, um, what is it, Java and Lord Vader, I have a lot of stuff to work with. So I want to go right at Fulcrum. I am able. They get so many buffs. They're gonna juice up. This whole team like crazy. Okay, that's community. So we've got Seer. Yeah, luckily, gas can handle it. I should have put the turret on five, so I don't know what else.
saying. This is a strong team, man. Oh no, she's gonna wipe someone out. Okay, well. Jeez. Why didn't I heal anything? You guys think Seer isn't the real deal still? I don't know if people thought that, but. God, 176k and I need to take her out. I can't handle this, guys. Fulcrum is ridiculous. I can't wait until I have this team. If I have dropped 10, that's not the start I want. Wow. Okay. Time for... Ray? I hope it goes a little bit smoother than that. I uh, have the exact data crawl where I use Mara Jade. And they have, I mean, yeah, I already looked at it. It's set 8. Which is good. I don't want set nine. And then Ray, two eleven health, five eighteen speed. Of course, extra crit damage and decent physical offense. So pretty well set up. Let's do it. Nothing to it. No cal is definitely. New, or I'm not used to it yet. I need yeah, that's good actually. I need this. Is what I need. Yeah, and then I want rain damage immunity, a sapo, mark on others, Ben. Good, she is ready for alt. That was perfect. Everyone got into damage immunity. If I could get Varus, that's great. Awesome. Okay, now just make sure. Get rid of the inspired there. Try to hold the Star Destroyer. I want them to take a turn. Oh, Ben, ben finally got to get on. That's funny. But this is looking fantastic. Not doing that, just a basic. It's just done for a star list done. Okay, yeah, keep. Oh, this is where I need this. 
We finish with the Star Destroyer. Perfect. Although we do have healing immunity on Palpatine and Obi Wan, which sucks. 63. Dang. Ah. I think that's the first time I've called him Obi Wan. It's an old Ben. It's <laughs> funny. Um, so for Jabba, this is the one, actually one of Filter Ufu. I want Ben right next to her. That's Cal. And what I want to do is Barris. And I want to have some decent health steal on a set 8. Which I'm always complaining when I roll it, but right now I'm actually trying to get it. 138 per set health steal and some crit damage. That should be good. Um, yeah, definitely. And it's only a, a, a level 3, which is plenty, but they're they're not super jacked up on defense. Although Kersantan, I think, is going to be eating whirlwinds like crazy. Um... Yeah, I don't know how this will go, but I think it's my best shot at a one shot. To also leave Lord Vader. Because you also gotta think we're gonna get a bunch of mastery from all their turn meter. Oh, I gotta call Ray. But I can't. Oh yeah, he can get around taunts, that's right, I need to utilize that. I want Cal to get to 30, that'd be good. Try to dink if it's Ben or Ray. Okay, yeah, so that's a bonus for us. I'm getting a lot of turn meter, I think. Gotta put on auto. Yeah, getting lots of mastery. One more of those, and I'll probably have the whole team down, other than Kersantan and Java, and then a third. We can win. As long as I get back to my turns. Need a turn until I'm at alt. Get on on it, cause I'll just do this. Didn't do much. Pop it. Auto. We need time. Get rid of Barris. Dang it, didn't kill them. Market boosh. Come on, guys. Yeah, just not getting around to turns fast enough. Gone. Okay, that's fine. 
trying to target him, but they're back up to full. Just need my alt, I think. I hope this one gets something done. I'll target Boosh with a Ben move. Yeah, this might have been a bad idea. If this ult doesn't kill anyone, that's really annoying. Yeah, that's really annoying. Gosh. I thought the mastery would be enough. I'm not gonna do like anything that sucks all right time to give Riva a go um, it could either be this or Jabba mirror I want to give them the chance um, I got extra five ability they got extra five ability but I mean inquisitors used to be able to beat Jabba even before Riva so uh, I'm gonna start with the ability block. Put healing immunity on everyone. That, uh, I don't like how weak the Inquisitor is. But I probably should have healed him instead there. Him up. Barely have any purge on him, that's annoying. Just got two stacks, but I need to make progress. See anything? I should have set my Java on. He's taking JMK. Oh, too much. Uh... Uh, ultimate charge, which is great. Uh, those bombs now. Good, don't kill fifth. Dang, he died anyway. Ah, oh, I'm gonna get the ultimate. Come on, kill someone. Okay, she's down. That's good. But they're gonna dink Riva. They're not there yet. I think it's still bugged on light side getting tanky too, so it's really annoying. One Grand Inquisitor, get, oh, not any good moves left. This is a disaster! As Arnold would say, I think. Okay, well, two down. I get Reva, and she's a dud. Gonna keep the result here, of course, but <sighs> I think I can take Jedi Master Luke in here to finish this off. Which is the one I was gonna just 
not know what to do with. But I want to save Java for the back. So they have a Reva. Gonna need that. I mean, she's durable. It is kind of annoying. They, like, never got death mark. I guess that's because Java's the one cleansing? Annoying. Uh, but I can do Jedi and not take my best best. So I can kind of leave Jedi Knight Rev and Jedi Knight Luke. Take Mace. Yoda, Mace. Hoda, I don't know. I kind of want to leave that Supreme Leader to Kylo counter. Bring too little. A Jolie, a Jolie. Shakti, I want to use with Bad Batch somewhere. Uh, I use Calcutta, and I'm, I'm not probably not gonna use my mouth <laughs> Uh, and then this is the one I want. So with no boosh in there, I can call assists right from the get-go. Which makes it easier. Uh, so I should get Yoda for more turn meter. Grab that speed up. Yoda every time I can because turn meter other than that try to spread the load Yeah okay, ability block Java looks kinda nice. Okay, ultimate is good, but I'm not getting through them as fast as I had hoped. They might kill someone with ult. Okay, got through him. I'm just gonna auto. Because they, they prioritize the special build, the granted ability anyway. What is that doing? It's doing 77k, but he's just so tanky. He does have the Omicron. Okay, once his protection is the real thick part, he's uh. So when he's out of that, he's a little bit weaker. Um. Unless Jabba targets Luke, I'm gonna lose someone here soon. And I think her Santon's honestly thicker than Jabba, so. Yeah, I think we'll get through Jabba fine. Okay, that's nice. I like that. Thank you. Um. <laughs> Give me a solid there. So on this job, I used two Galactic Legends and Reba. 
Next time, I will be needing to figure something else out. Assuming I even get through this. Uh, see, this is going kind of slow. I'm doing 40k on him. It's kind of ridiculous. I thought it. I have like no mods on Luke or something. This spell on a basic. He's not gonna get through him. He is healing up. Why am I doing only 40k? Did I legitimately like forget mods on JML or something during the join period? I think I may have. I think... I think I forgot mods. I think I don't have mods on JML. <sighs> I cannot believe this is how the first match is going. Uh, I'm gonna try this team. He doesn't have his teammates anymore, so we should have limited extra offense. But I don't think my JML should have been doing that little. This isn't gonna work, we're barely doing anything. I dropped as many banners as I can. I can't advantage back. He's so fat. That's the thing, he's so fat. Get some. They're being dumb. Ah, push. What? He's, I'm never getting anywhere. Okay, he seems to be getting somewhere, but it's not, you know, it's not. I need advantage. I need a dispel. I, I literally don't know what to do right now. Okay, just gonna ignore him for a second. He doesn't exist. Java does not exist. I'm gonna try Malgus. Uh, they have... That. Not too much. I mean... Do we use Java now at this point for the solo Java? I... I don't know. Might have to use CLS or something crazy. This, this, this has gone so poorly, like so badly. Oh, 
it's kind of nice to get cities first. Sith Trooper gets new life. Okay. I'm gonna get alt. Good ones. I oh, just have these guys left. I want to take those two out with the second link. I don't think I'll accidentally kill Malik. Question, is he too tanky? He's not. Yo, Ken, if you're watching, I watched your predictions for this season. You said you'd think there'd be way less frustration. I'm gonna say that is wrong. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna come back to that. And just try Spreemler Kylo here like I was thinking. Separatist. Mandalorian. And then Night Sisters. See. You two in the back. And the Night Sister Datacron with the ability blocks actually lining up pretty well for me. I get extra good damage. Uh, offense, health steal. It actually looks really good. And then there's the ability block. Um, what they have, Sith revive prote uh, prevention. Pretty well modded. Pretty fast. He outspeeds me, which unfortunate. I wish I could outspeed him. Um, I don't know if Candrus. It's gonna, I think Candor's probably gonna go before Spreemon or Kylo, and then I just gotta hope you know, kill Armorer or something with a barrage. That's the main hope. Yeah, okay. Candor's goes, and he goes on Watts, which is fine, actually. Let's get the stun. And then, if I can just... If she can survive... Oh, nice. Three stacks. Okay, that's... Kinda nice. Sucks. She died from dots. I mean, she doesn't come back. That's annoying. I have to pop, pop this early because Maul's at five stacks. <laughs> Hope he's not too slow. Come on. That's. You know. Could be worse. I mean, I have the full armor thing, so I can actually. Charge and Maul can be stunned there. Pop it. I just want to stun them all again. I don't want him gaining any anguish. There we go. Nice. Without uh, all the stacks of Beskar, this 
becomes a little bit harder because he does not charge up as much without his team. Uh, that being said, Lord Vader is charging up pretty well there too. But there we go, he is down. Okay, he's down. Um, well, actually, I could probably use Jedi Revan and Jedi Luke against Java. Might work. I've used like all my good teams now. Yeah, let me try that with Bastila too. Which really sucks. I mean, like, on huge mistakes this time around. I do want to do my best to save a Qui Gon team. So I'm low on everything right now. Okay. Let's go. Get some big damage. Using the first order, trying to clean it up, it was a waste in that I don't have them available, but it didn't cost me banners. Bonus protection from losing. Is he like getting bulk from his dead surviving teammates? be doing that because he gains bonus protection. I don't know if I'll do enough damage here. Uh, the repulse actually will be nice. I want. I want. Of course he recovers there. Um, there we go, man, actually. Ah, oh, he just, he's so fat. He is so fat. Gonna die at fatty. Okay, come on, come on. Not doing that. Want that buff? Come on, just someone else attack. that does not heal. Get out of here! Get out of here! Okay, let's see Reva in the back. <sighs> no Reva! Okay. 
Maybe we can clear, and maybe we can win, although I used my anti-Zori team. So good job, uh, CLS, Raddus, Bounty Hunters, Wampa, Bad Batch, Aiden. Yeah, uh, this is possible. I got Qui-Gon. This is possible. It's going to be a little hard. Uh, so what's possible is I only dropped battles on Jabba. Uh, so that's a loss of 30 banners from drops as opposed to his 40 with two separate drops. But I need to be perfect from here on out. Uh, so just got to figure this out. All right, I got my desperation plan in place. Starting with uh, CLS here. It's like, it's kind of... Yeah, kind of risky because, you know, last season we had the Chubia Datacron, but we get extra survivability here. Um, bringing in the defense for sure. And they just have the 5% ramping, I mean, which is painful, but uh, we should be able to get around L3 uh, fine enough. Done you. Give me some counters. Okay, you're just gone. I don't want him going. Okay, this actually wasn't too bad. Oh, I was a little bit worried, but no, this was just easy street. So that's good. That's a good start. 64. Um, and then for this team, we want Bad Batch with Shock T. Uh, you, you, and then she should be at the top. Love Java. My plan is Java for Zori, because Zori is the most scary. <laughs> Look at all these set eight. Being ignored. Um, that one has some offense. That's nice. Okay, come on. They put the thing on shock T, which is not great. I need some turns. A ability blocked Echo, which is terrible. He's ability blocked. This is looking pretty bad. Like, really, really bad. Which is very frustrating. Okay. Oh my gosh. I thought, I thought there was no way. No, 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 no. Echo, go! What the heck? Echo! 100% turn meter! I passed it to him! I passed him 100% turn meter! What is going- What is going on? He's never getting to go? He's gonna go the whole match with that. Okay. Give me that daze. Don't. Oh. It's like. Okay, it's fine. It's just like 3v3. <laughs> just like 3v3. Come on, you guys. You, you know what you're doing. You've. You've been through everything together, haven't you? <laughs> you two can do it. Maybe not. 
Okay, I think I need to try to see myself. On oh, defense. Oh no, I need to kill her. Okay. Come on, you two. You can handle a stupid pirate. Kill him. I have no idea what that whole thing was. And I have no idea how I won it. But I'll take it. Okay, taking a breather. I've recovered from that madness. Um, I feel bad for respecting, disrespecting Sana. Although, for the most part, that was real, just really bad luck with who Hondo put outmaneuvered on, or captive. Because if I just get to go with Echo and put days on them, then that's that, that doesn't go anywhere. Um, gonna use Bounty Hunters here against Dash. And Boss Glee to definitely go in that way. Instead of like Aura or what's her face? Fennec lead, and I'm not even gonna use Fennec, I'm using Django here. because uh, I just wanna survive. Django prevents revives, which is nice. I didn't set him on defense. Um uh, actually just turn me to thing. So I will get to go again, so Definitely take out Dash. He's there. Win condition. And I don't know if they did stop me. They're annoying with all the buffs though. They're like really tanky. It seems. I'm um, getting some progress on Vandor. Um, I'm gonna kill Wheel. And then just make sure I finish him off with Django. Debuffed and I didn't get to. Just take out Ness now. I feel like I'm determined to do it the reverse way everyone does, killing Vandor first. <sighs> okay. I 
don't know why I thought of this. I'm just laughing. I'm thinking like this is such a hard Grand Arena. And I always want a smooth Grand Arena, but I guess for people watching, they kind of like when it's more difficult. I was thinking of that John F. Kennedy, like what he's quoting. We do not do things because they are easy, but because they are hard. <laughs> for some reason, I don't know why that popped in my head. But it did. Um, okay, so I think I can handle this. I want to do nice profundity there. Executor here plus the bomber. A tie bomber, maybe? Yeah, I'll, I'll think about it in a second. I want to finish ground. Uh, starting with Java here, like it's, I mean, what else am I going to use here? Skiff. Look at all these set eights. I guess I'll take that. This light side helps Boosh and Skiff. If I lose this. immunity like triggered in the middle I I wish I just did a job of mirror that might be the way to go but I don't know because when you're doing the mirror they are dumber uh, the ones you're facing boom how much survivability do they have He has a damage immunity there. That's really weird to use Java on, sorry. It's taking way too long for a galactic legend to get through, but... Go, oh, 65. Two more to handle. I'm gonna do a Qui-Gon mirror here. Datacron? I don't think I need a Datacron. I'll do a true mirror. I'll bring in Plo, but he's tier 12. Okay, yeah, that's kind of... much you go for? Oh, actually... That's more of a mistake. Return meter. I wanted to kill their Qui-Gon first. It didn't happen. Okay, well. Foresight really helps. Uh, 
And, you know, Plo doing his thing. Terminator game, that really helps. Seven, I can't afford to lose seven banners. Uh, I'm gonna hate when I do the calculation for ships. Just lose too many. Um, what I wanted here is actually a mirror match. Which is really weird to do. Uh, get my best light side data cron. It's protection and health. That sounds pretty good. I don't know how exactly to play this, but I know my advantage is they're dumb. And they will probably attack Jin. And I can exploit that. And I can just avoid doing AoEs first. Like, he's never gonna drop tenacity up the whole game. I don't know if I want hope first or second, because if he kills people, I can bring him back. Alright, here it's coming down to it. Yeah, he got it. City up a whole dang game. I don't know, I want to wait till someone dies. Yeah, there we go. Okay, that's really good. Ras is looking healthy. Some back 59 that's yeah, that's rough but it was a win okay that's a land clear now we gotta figure out if it's possible to win all right and I'm not gonna not gonna tell you guys or spoil it what I need to actually score here um but I think it's like the thing I need I'm having a hard time deciding is whether I should just use the normal executor counter to profundity or if I should try executor with the bomber. Um, I'm just gonna go with this one because I'm more used to it and 
guess I can select the fleet. Yeah, there. And... I like set Chimera on defense with Sith ships. So I can just bring in the extra stuff. Yeah, it feels kind of weird, but I mean, there's no point bringing Darth Vader in, I don't think. But these two, uh, they're definitely top notch. Uh, so let's do it. Get him down, and AoE hopefully kills. <sighs> I'm gonna do that. Come on, Falcon. I don't want to taunt. I want a chance to die. Yes, okay. There we go. That's what I want to see. Make room for the bomber. That was like pretty quick to kill their bomber. That's some good work. And I don't care about him. Taunt. Get the offense up. Clear that off. Reapply and dispel. Excellent. And my next reinforcement will be I interceptor. I wanna just go for Falcon. He recently it recently did okay there we go. That was like perfect. He had recently done his wiggle, so I knew he'd be exposed for a while. I thought he was. I need to use this more. 73, that's good. It's a good score. Very nice. Uh, executor, definitely using profundity. Yeah, and this is the one we want. I just realized I'm so hungry. It is... 7.36am for me. I start work at 8. I'm really hungry. Been up since before 6. Just hang in there. Okay, this spread the love, which is good for me. Need some healing. One thing I want to know is why my JML did so little damage. One job, that's what I'm thinking about right now. I like his grant ability.
There it is. Nail in the coffin for this fleet. Banners. We got everyone coming before, so. Full banners, 74. Nice, nice, nice. And then just Executor here. That's all you need. Pro don't even need all five. I think it's safe to say we're going to full clear. Let's start working on this. We're going to have to target it anyway. <laughs> Melted. But he doesn't get hit till the end. Okay, that contract thingy. I was actually trying to hit the special, but whatever. bringing him in because I think I can kill with this attack. Yeah. 74! All great banners on fleets. Is it enough? No, it's not. Um, I did want to share right before fleets because I did the math and I knew it was impossible. I needed to average like 79 banners to win. Um, I mean, yeah, that kind of sucks. 13 banners... And I I dropped a lot of that on battles where I didn't drop. But look at this. I mean, it was a really messy fight, but one, one, one shot, one shot. We one shot all fleets back here. One shot, one shot, one shot. And in front, one shot, one shot, one shot, five battles so yeah um i haven't seen anyone else do any grand arena yet this is early in the cycle i haven't watched anyone go against java so i don't know if anyone else is having had similar issues uh but next round i am setting my java <laughs> um i'm probably gonna bring jmk on offense uh, but yeah, Jabba is a monster, and I might set my Reva. Uh, but, you know, if I didn't use Reva, I mean, Reva did help me win. Um, honestly, if Jabba Mirror would have worked, then I should have done that. Then Reva would have been able to take care of Zora easily, and I'd win. So, this was winnable. This is definitely winnable. Uh, it was just this one guy, and I didn't know how to approach him. Um, I I don't regret using Spreemlayer Kylo on Lord Vader, because I think that's what I needed to get by it, especially with the R9 Maul. Um, and even that was kind of scary. Lord Vader is definitely strong. But yeah, I'm not sure what the go-to for Jabba is going to be this season. I used Aphra last season, and it was kind of a mixed bag. I don't really have confidence that she can, can like, win right up. 
And just with what I saw with the Java cleanup, that's a nightmare too. So really need to search for some kind of reliable one-shot option. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed this one. It was a bumpy ride, especially that bad batch match. Oh, let me know what you think about that. All right, guys. Don't forget to like, sub, see ya.